Welcome back famous fans to your go-to channel for the juiciest, funniest, most ironic celebrity drama stories, famous faces, Scoop TV. If you're ready to dive into the whirlwind world of Hollywood's elite, you've come to the right place. Today we've got a tale of pop, love and well, a sprinkle of divorce rumors that's sure to keep you on the edge of your seat. You know how it goes in Hollywood, folks one minute you're renewing vows in a lavish ceremony and the next you're dancing the night away solo to a breakup anthem. It's a roller coaster of emotions and we're here to break it all down for you. So grab your popcorn and settle in because we're diving head first into the latest on Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck. Is it love on the rocks or just another day in the life of Benefit 2.0? Whatever it is, you know it's going to be filled with glitz, glamour, and a whole lot of drama. Now picture this, it's Thursday night, and Bruno Mars is lighting up the stage at the new Intuit Dome in Inglewood, California. But who's lighting up the VIP section? None other than our favorite triple threat diva, Jennifer Lopez. The crowd's going wild as Bruno crones. It's a beautiful night. We're looking for something dumb to do. And guess who's throwing her arms in the air, flipping her hair and singing right along? Yep, Jennifer Lopez herself just belting out. Hey, baby, I think I want to marry you. Ironic, isn't it? Given the current state of her own marital bliss, or should we say lack thereof? Now, if that isn't a whole vibe, I don't know what is. Let's talk fashion because JLo was serving casual cheek realness. A simple white crop top, blue pants, hair pulled back into a loose ponytail, and those iconic oversized glasses because even when you're dancing through potential heartbreak, you've got to look flawless, right? Stack bracelets, hoop earrings, classic JLo, just giving us all the understated glam we didn't know we needed. But wait, there's more. Our girl was spotted backstage chatting it up with none other than Ashton Kutcher. Now, what were they talking about? A new rom-com, maybe, or just some tips on handling the tabloid frenzy that follows every move she makes. Whatever it was, they seemed to be having a good laugh. Oh, and did I mention that this whole scene went down on Ben Affleck's birthday? Yep, while Ben was probably blowing out candles on a sad little cake somewhere in Brentwood, Jennifer Lopez was out here living her best life with Bruno and Ashton. Ouch, no Instagram tributes, no gushy posts, just the solo snap of Jennifer Lopez posing in a sheer gown. If that doesn't scream I'm doing just fine without you, I don't know what does. And speaking of doing just fine, Jennifer Lopez has been busy house hunting in Los Angeles. Why you ask? Well, it turns out that Ben has moved out of their $68 million mansion and bought his home. You heard that right, $68 million. That's a lot of zeros for a place that might soon be just a memory. The house is up for sale and Jennifer Lopez has been spotted all over Jennifer Lopez checking out new digs. Is this the final chapter for Benifer or just a temporary blip in their Hollywood love story? Now before we jump to conclusions, let's take a moment to remember that this isn't J. Dotlow's first rodeo. She's been through the highs and lows of love more times than we can count Mark Anthony, Alex Rodriguez, and of course her first go round with Ben back in 2002. So when a source tells us that Jennifer Lopez is furious and humiliated, we can't help but wonder, is this just another bump in the road for a woman who's been through it all? Or is it really the end of the line for Benefit 2.0? Let's not forget that there are five kids caught in this Hollywood drama, Jennifer Lopez twins, Max and Emmy, and Ben's three with Jennifer Garner, Violet, Finn, and Samuel. Blending families is never easy, especially under the harsh glare of the spotlight. But sources say Jennifer Lopez hasn't fully accepted that it's over. She's a romantic after all. Could there still be hope for these two? Or is Jennifer Lopez dancing her way into a new chapter without Ben? One thing's for sure, Jennifer Lopez is a queen of reinvention. From the Bronx to Hollywood, from chart-topping hits to box office smashes, she's done it all. So whether she's dancing solo at a Bruno Mars concert or finding a new love nest in LA, she's not slowing down anytime soon. So what do you think, famous fans? Is this just a rough patch for Jennifer Lopez and Ben? Or are we witnessing the beginning of the end? And how do you feel about Jennifer Lopez singing Mary Main while her own marriage is on the rocks? Drop your thoughts in the comments below and let's get this gossip train rolling. And as always, if you enjoyed the scoop, don't forget to like and subscribe for more latest updates. This is Famous Faces Scoop TV, where drama is fun and never a dull moment. We'll be back with more celebrity drama, irony, and all the juicy details you crave.
Until next time, bizo bizo.